Available now. Link below. Attention Walmart shoppers, if you've bought meat, seafood, or citrus products from the retail giant anytime between October 2018 and January of 2024, listen up. You could be entitled to a slice of a staggering $45 million settlement pie. That's right, Walmart stands accused of overcharging customers and now they're paying the price. But here's the catch, the clock is ticking and the deadline to claim your share is just around the corner. If you don't act fast, you could miss out on a payday of up to $500. In this shocking expose, we'll dive deep into the scandal. It's rocking the retail world, revealing how Walmart allegedly misled millions of customers and left them paying the price. But more importantly, we'll show you exactly how to secure your rightful compensation before time runs out. And trust me, you don't want to miss my final thought on this one. And just like Walmart allegedly overcharged customers for meat and produce, greedy power companies are inflating your energy bills to record highs. With 20 million households struggling to keep the lights on, it's time to fight back against these shocking practices. That's why I'm excited to introduce a game-changing little device that plugs into your wall outlet, slashing your power bills and putting money back in your pocket. Now, this innovative gadget optimizes your home energy uses, usage extends the life of your appliances, and ensures a stable, safe flow of electricity. Don't let the power companies win. Visit DontWastePower.com and claim your 60-day risk-free trial, 65% discount, free shipping, and bonus gifts before they're gone. Take control of your energy costs today at DontWastePower.com. Now back to our story. The retail giant Walmart finds itself at the center of a legal firestorm as a $45 million class action settlement looms over the company's head. The lawsuit known as Kukarinas v. Walmart alleges that the superstore chain systematically overcharged customers for pre-weighted meat, poultry, pork, and seafood products, as well as mislabeled the weight of bag citrus fruits. Watch. Well, Walmart customers who bought certain weighted groceries or bagged fruit may be eligible for a part of a $45 million settlement. The class action lawsuit claimed Walmart overcharged customers who purchased groceries sold by weight. Customers who bought eligible sold by weight groceries between October 19th, 2018 and January 19th, 2024 qualify for this settlement. That's a long span of time, folks, so it might be one of you. Walmart shoppers have until June 5th to submit a claim to be included. Now, according to the lawsuit, Walmart's deceptive practices span from October 19, 2018 to January 19 of 2024, affecting countless unsuspecting shoppers. And the claims are nothing short of shocking, with accusations that Walmart inflated product weights at the register, mislabeled the weight of bag citrus fruits, and overpriced items nearing their expiration dates. As the June 5, 2024 deadline for filing a claim rapidly approaches, Walmart customers who purchased the affected products during the specified time period are urged to take action. With potential payouts of up to $500 per claimant, the stakes are high and the clock is ticking. Now, to be eligible for a portion of the settlement, customers must have purchased weighted goods such as prepackaged meat, poultry, pork, or seafood, or bags such as products like oranges, grapefruits, tangerines, and navel oranges from Walmart during the aforementioned period. While receipts are not mandatory for filing a claim, those who can provide proof of purchase may be entitled to a higher payout with a maximum of 2% of the total amount spent, capped at $500. And claimants without receipts can still receive compensation, however, in smaller increments based on the number of products they estimate to have purchased. Now, Walmart, for its part, has denied any wrongdoing, but has agreed to the settlement to avoid the mounting costs of ongoing litigation. The retail behemoth's reputation, however, hangs in the balance as the court of public opinion weighs in on the allegations. The lawsuit highlights the severity of the accusations against Walmart and the potential impact on countless consumers who may have been overcharged for their purchases. Now, the road to resolution is not yet complete as the proposed settlement awaits the final approval from the United States District Court for the Middle District of Florida on June 12th of 2024. Once approved, claimants can expect to receive their compensation electronically through services like Venmo, Zelle, AXH, or virtual prepaid MasterCards with paper checks available for those unable to accept electronic payments. Now, this next clip delves into the details of the settlement process and what affected consumers can expect moving forward. Take a look. Is the Walmart weighted grocery settlement real? Our sources are the official settlement website and court documents. We checked those court records and we can verify, yes, this is a legitimate settlement. So who's eligible to get money? 
Walmart shoppers who bought bagged citrus or prepackaged meat that's sold by weight between 2018 and 2024. The lawsuit claims customers were overcharged thanks to deceptive sticker prices. Take a look at these pictures from the court filings. When this pork roast was originally packaged, Walmart was charging $2.34 a pound. The roast weighs 5.13 pounds, so it cost $12. But later, the price was reduced to $2.12 a pound, according to this sticker on the shelf. That means it should have cost $10.88 at the cash register, but the customer was still charged $12 because even though the lower cost per pound was updated in the system, as you can see here, the system also increased the pork's weight to 5.66 pounds. The suit claims Walmart did something similar with several other kinds of meat and seafood, as well as pre-bagged oranges, tangerines, and grapefruits. If you have receipts for any of those items, you can get back 2% of what you paid for them, up to $500. If you don't have receipts, you might still be able to get 10 or 20 bucks, depending on how many eligible items you buy. We have more information on how you can file a claim at verifythis.com. As the deadline for filing claims draws near, affected Walmart customers are encouraged to visit the official settlement website to submit their claims electronically or by mail. The website also provides detailed information on the products covered under the settlement and the varying levels of compensation based on the availability of receipts. Now, the case serves as a reminder of the importance of corporate transparency and the power of consumer advocacy. As Walmart faces the consequences of its alleged actions, shoppers nationwide are left to question the integrity of the retail giant and the true cost of low prices. If you got value from this report, tap subscribe. It's time for my final thought. The Walmart class action settlement is more than just a legal battle. It's a wake-up call for consumers and corporations alike. As the largest private employer in the United States, Walmart has a responsibility to maintain the trust of its customers and conduct business with the utmost integrity. The allegations of overcharging and mislabeling strike at the heart of this trust, eroding the foundation of the customer-retailer relationship. But this case also highlights the power of consumer advocacy and the importance of holding even the most powerful corporations accountable for their actions. By coming together and taking legal action, Walmart customers have sent a clear message. Deceptive practices will not be tolerated and justice will be served. As the deadline for the filing claims approach, it's crucial for affected customers to make their voices heard and to claim what's rightfully theirs. Only by standing up for our rights as consumers can we hope to create a more transparent and equitable retail landscape. Congratulations, you made it to the end of the video. Now keep up your quest for truth with this next news report. And if you found our channel enlightening, join the millions who agree with you. Tap subscribe. Thank you for watching the Next News Network.